how to create a positive company culture with a remote team. Teamwork is so important that it is virtually impossible for you to reach the heights of your capabilities or make the money that you want without becoming very good at it. Brian Tracy. Many companies have recently transitioned to working 100% remotely. If your team is used to being together in the physical office, you might be struggling with the challenges of unexpected remote work. One of the best things you can do for your company is to create a positive company culture. This is important for any company, but when your employees are working remotely, creating a vibrant culture becomes absolutely essential. Here are four strategies that you can use to forge a positive company culture with your remote team. Number one, create or refine your company values. Does your company have values? If not, now is the time to define them. Company values are the beliefs and principles your company is based on. These values define your vision. They also serve as a great set of guidelines that outline how your company does business. Company values are important because they help shape your company culture and identity. Having a list of company values to follow will help your employees feel like they belong. Your team will feel more motivated and engaged, and they'll even be able to do their work and represent your business more effectively too. If you don't have company values, ask yourself what's important to you and your company. Maybe you care about integrity, accountability, and having fun. Those could be your primary company values. If you already have company values but haven't thought about them recently, it may be time to revisit those values and tweak them as your company evolves. Number two, communicate your culture. Your company's culture can be described as your company's personality. Company culture determines the type of work environment that your company has. For example, one company's culture might be goal-oriented, highly structured and focused around maximum efficiency. Another company might choose to have a culture that's more lighthearted and laid back with plenty of time for fun. How can you communicate your culture to your employees? First, set expectations for communication. Make it clear how you want your employees to communicate with each other and how you will communicate with them. Next, make sure your employees understand and live your values. Share your company values with your employees to help them envision them and encourage them to live out those values in the workplace and beyond. It goes without saying that you should lead by example and live out those values yourself. It's also essential to encourage an environment that involves open communication and feedback. This type of company culture will make employees feel much more comfortable, and when they feel secure in communicating with you and receiving feedback, they'll be able to get their work done to the best of their ability. Number three, use tools to help with managing your remote team. Tools have a lot of benefits when it comes to a remote team. They can help your team stay connected and on track, they can save time, allowing you to work more efficiently, and they can also inject some much needed lightheartedness into the workday. Tools allow for both collaboration and fun. Collaboration on projects using tools that offer real-time messaging and have file sharing capabilities and use GIFs and memes to keep the tone light. What tools should your team invest in? Consider Slack for easy messaging about projects, Asana for assigning tasks, Harvest for time tracking, and Zoom for video calls. These are just a few suggestions, and a simple internet search will turn up dozens of other tools that can be used for a myriad of purposes. And finally, number four, create rituals and traditions. Your team might be entirely remote, but that doesn't mean you can't spend quality time together. Create traditions such as a morning huddle, a short daily meeting that establishes priorities for the day, a Zoom happy hour once a week, or eating lunch together over FaceTime. Traditions like these will allow your employees to bond. Rituals and traditions create a sense of belonging for your employees, and the closer your employees are, the better they are able to work together. Building a sense of unity among your team will result in work getting done efficiently as well. Now take some time to work through these strategies. Define your company values, culture, and traditions will help your remote team thrive. Now we want to hear from you, and our question today is this. What's the first step you're going to take towards creating a positive company culture? Leave a comment below and Brian will follow up with you. Thanks for watching and remember, as Brian always says, if you want to change your future, take action and take action now. If you enjoyed this video and you feel it was valuable, subscribe to my channel, like this video, and share this video with your friends. Don't forget to click the button on the screen for a free gift. Thanks again for watching.